Hi everybody and welcome to Proof Weight Loss Surgery Works this Friday. My name is Tom and I'm your Friday vlogger. Um, this week's topic is about inter, inter, inner, listen to me, inter, inner strength. God, I can't even talk right. We're having a heat wave. Philadelphia is hot. We're under the weather. Oh my God, it's sticky. It's smelly. It's, oh, it's disgusting here. Hence the air conditioner noise behind me. Yeah, 92 to get. Can't even talk. 92 today. Um, well, right now it's 92. And um, it's hot and humid. For those of you who were in Las Vegas or live in California, you know you don't have the humidity like we have the humidity. When we were in Vegas last week, it was 99 degrees and it didn't feel this hot. It's sticky hot here. Disgusting. This week's topic, inner strength. Question, how do you focus on the positive changes you are making, the progress of your journey and the work you have ahead of you without letting the negative talk win? <clears throat> well, interesting topic. Um, I don't know. I don't know how I do it, but I do it. I'm very positive with my weight loss journey. I have I have been from day one. My lowest weight was 165. My highest weight was 280. I am currently 185, 190, give or take, whatever. Um, <clears throat> yes, I had a slight regain. The positive side of the regain is I'm not stressed over it. I know why it happened. I know how it happened. But I never had a negative issue with it happening. Because um, the positive side of me is I am still healthy. And that is what I wanted out of this whole journey. I wanted to be healthy. I didn't do this to be vain and to be skinny and, you know, have a beach body, beach type body, yeah. What do they call that? Um, yeah, that's why I'm getting confused because I'm thinking, what the hell do they call that? Not beach body, um, I don't know, whatever. But the positive out, outlook on myself is I, I've always thought positive, no matter what. Even though I was gaining weight, and there was a few times that, you know, it hits me. It's like, oh my God, I'm gaining weight. Like, really, you know, like, oh, how am I going to control this and whatnot? And then I think positive, and I'm like, you know what? I'm in this for the long haul, and I'm going to beat obesity. That's what my journey is all about, beating obesity. And I am in the overweight category. I may always be in the overweight category because I'm not trying to have a beach body, you know. So I'm okay with that. I made peace with myself when I gained some weight back and I made peace with myself where I am right now. I had my uh, third year follow-up just last week with my surgeon and he's very happy with my progress. I'm not in the obese BMI category and that's what this is all about. Um, inner strength, that is my inner strength. I'm not obese and I look good and I feel good. That's the positive energy that I portray and I live with day to day. When you I feel, I, I, I strongly believe this. If you set yourself up with goals and you get to that goal and you don't maintain it, you will go into maybe a depression and you will have some guilt and you will, you know, start um, bashing yourself because you've gained a couple pounds. 
I went into this journey knowing that I was going to gain back 10 to 15 pounds because my surgeon told me I would. He said, when your body's ready to stop, it will, and it'll adjust itself, and you will stable off, which I did, and you will most likely gain 10 to 15 pounds back. I did. Um, so I was very well aware of that fact. I didn't have goals even though I wanted to get down to 150. When I hit 165, I felt that that was unrealistic. Looking in the mirror and I saw myself and I was like, oh my God, you look sick. Like, really? Like, no, nah, we have to gain some weight because I didn't like the way that I look. You know, positive. I thought positive. It wasn't about regaining all my weight, but it was a point of looking good at the weight that I am. And that's why I started to eat more to maintain that. Now, in the process of gaining a few pounds back, I was still exercising back then. You know, I was running, I was power walking, you know, I was still energized, you know, and I just kept focusing on the positive, never being obese again. I never looked at the fact that um, I'm never going to regain, and I hate when people say, never again. I hate that because I believe that's setting yourself up for failure in your own mind. Because if you regain, you're gonna think you're a failure. That's what never again means. Never again means never having it happen again. And therefore, if you get down to your lowest weight and you gain back five or 10 pounds, you start to freak yourself out and be like, oh no, 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 I can't do this. What the hell's wrong? And you know, you start beating yourself up. That's unrealistic. What is realistic is you being happy with yourself and living a healthy lifestyle. And that's what weight loss surgery is all about. And if you do not think on those lines, you are gonna have some major issues. All right, think about that. That's my take on this week's topic about inner strength and staying positive and, um, what is this? Journey and the work you have ahead of you without letting the negative talk win. Yeah, the negative talk will never win. I mean, yeah, I've had some thoughts about the regain issue and they didn't last very long and it was like an overnight type of thing and whatnot. You know, it wasn't a weekly thing <clears throat> because the negative is never going to win because my fight is not up until the day that I die. I didn't have surgery to give up. <clears throat> I had surgery to fight and win obesity and to be healthy. That does not mean a number on the scale because the number on the scale doesn't define who I am. I hope this makes sense to you if you're still watching this. And um, if so, I am here every Friday on Proof Weight Loss Surgery Works. Please come back next Friday and join me with next week's topic. With that being said, I'm going to get off of here. Oh, let me just throw this out there. I am Philly Tomcat, P-H-I-L-L-Y-T-O-M-C-A-T. I do have my own channel, not that I do weekly videos there, but my whole weight loss surgery journey is documented there from the night before I went into surgery up until this past month. So come and check me out. Check out my videos, you know. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed, and I will see you back next Friday. Bye for now, and as you see, I didn't edit this video because I don't care, it's too hot. See you next Friday, bye.